E aí pessoal do YouTube, quem fala o Docs, trazendo mais um vídeo. E hoje vamos continuar com o Capitão Spirit. Pô, por que eu fiquei preso aí? Não pode, mano. Não pode, mano. Casa do Rei Mond. Ah, tá. Rei Mond é o vizinho. Agora tá certo. Deixa eu ver aqui se tem uma carta. Deixa eu ver se. Negócio aqui. Não sei o que é. Ok. Vamos entrar. E usar o um negocinho da. Em cima do mapa. Só vou ver se aqui abre. Abre, abre, abre. Tinha pego a chave. Depois a gente vai pra casa então. Cadê a luz? Cadê? Cadê? Yes. Olha o esquilo, pô, que entrou aí. Ai, ai. Será assim. <laughs> Gente, display. Yeah. Só falta um capacete nesse uniforme aí. Credado com código, mano. Tem que achar o código do celular. Tem que achar. Achar o código desse cadeado. Vamos tentar colocar esse. A ver igual o mapa. Se fosse você, nem tirar, hoje vai sair de novo. Capacete, não faço ideia de onde que a gente pode tirar, mano. Certo, cadê o mapa mesmo? Não... Tinha um mapa onde? Calma aí, calma aí, calma aí. Dad, you, you sleeping? Hey, wake up. Dad, come on. Huh? What? Who's there? Who's that? Dad, it, it's just me, Chris. Whoa, whoa, hold on, buddy, okay? Jesus. I look okay? No, I tripped. Can't even watch one goddamn game. Fuck! That's just great. Oh, I think I sprained my foot. Shit. Chris, why did you wake me up? You you told me to wake you up. I thought I thought you said. The pine tree? Pine tree? I can't even walk in my own house, man. You should be careful when you're... You know... When you wake up. Don't be a smartass, Chris. 
I'm not in the mood right now. Yeah, Dad. Okay. Jesus Christ, who is that? Go answer. If it's some salesperson or some church group, you just close the door on them. It's nobody's business. This is our castle, and it's our family. Right? Right. Chris, how are you? Good, Mrs. Reynolds. Just... just... Just? Just... hanging out playing video games. You boys and your video games. You should play games outside like we used to. Like your dad used to. Oh, I know, I know. I'm old. But I did see you clearing that snow off the front porch. So good of you. Actually, I was going for a nice walk and I thought I heard a loud noise over here. Is everything okay? Totally. Me and my dad were just decorating the tree and I tripped over the lights and the tree almost crashed on me, but Dad caught it, and he fell, so, so... Gee, that's some story. Is everybody all right? Um, yeah. Must have been quite a scare. I hope you have something else planned for today. Me and my dad are gonna go buy a real pine Christmas tree. Wait, wait. You said you tripped over the Christmas tree lights, but you're going to get another one? No, I tripped over the... the Christmas lights, not the tree. Chris, I want you to tell me the truth. I am. I didn't mean I had a tree, just the lights. It, it, it's no big deal, Claire, seriously. Well, I'm glad to see you're taking care of your father. Of course. We're both on the same team. You're a good son, Chris. Listen, Chris, I'm only steps away from your house. If you ever feel scared, you can come visit us anytime, day or night. Understand? We here for you. Okay. Sure. Thanks. Thanks, Claire. I promise I'll see you later. So what did that nosy bitch want? N nothing. Oh, nothing, huh? I was listening. I heard it all. You could have gotten rid of her. I tried. Man, I bet you wanted to tell her what a shitty dad you have. Huh? No, she just wanted to say hi. I didn't say anything, Dad. I swear. Dad, please believe me. Jesus, stop that whining. You're not a baby anymore. Oh, boo-hoo, Daddy. Believe me. Grow up. But I... You're just... Just like your mom. Every time I look at you, I tell me, you talk. Stop it. I, just, just, I see your face. Why? And if it wasn't for you, she would have never taken the car that day. Never. Oh, hey, Chris, look, hey, I didn't mean that, buddy. Yes! Yes, you did! No, listen, Chris! 